This video will demonstrate the process of deploying a test in a Blackboard course and setting test options. Once you have created or imported a test in Blackboard, it is available to you as the instructor through the Test, Surveys, and Pools area. To make the test available to students, you have to deploy it in a content area or folder in your course. I will deploy a sample test in the Lesson 7 folder in the Lessons content area of a course. Select Test from the Assessments menu in the action bar. Select the test to add to the folder from the list of available tests. Tests that have already been deployed in your course will no longer be listed here. A test can only be deployed in one location within a course. Press Submit to continue. Enter a description and instructions for the test in the text area provided. Now you will need to set the options for the test. Make the link available must be set to yes for students to be able to see the test. For quizzes and practice tests, you may want to allow two attempts. Turn on the multiple attempts option by clicking the checkbox. Enter a specified number of attempts. Leaving this option off will allow students only one attempt. To create a timed test, turn on the Set Timer option. Set the time limit using the hour and minute boxes. I will set a time limit of 10 minutes. Turn the Auto Submit option on to have Blackboard automatically end the student's attempt and submit the test for grading once the time limit is reached. If this option is left off, the student can work on the test past the time limit. Blackboard will save the student's answers but will not record a grade until you view the attempt in the Grade Center. I also recommend turning on the Force Completion option for timed tests. Set Display After and Display Until Dates to control student access to a test based on date restrictions. If these options are turned on, students will only see a test during that span of time. You may also enter a due date for the test. Make sure the Include This Test in Grade Center Score Calculations option is on if the test is to be part of the final course grade. Select the type of feedback to show students after the test is submitted. You can show the overall test score, the students submitted answers, the correct answers, and feedback. Determine how you want the questions to be presented in the test. The questions can all be shown on a single test page, or questions can be shown one per page. Turn on the randomized questions option to show the questions in a random order for each student. Press Submit. The test is now deployed with my selected options. Students can find this test in the Lesson 7 folder in this course.